What's up guys, everything up with Pro here. I'm out here in the Columbia River. It's a really rainy day, you know, typical wash day. So what are we doing here? I have the Samsung Galaxy S7. I've already done a water test, but that's not the point of this video. With this video, I wanna go above and beyond what we did in the water test and see what it really takes to kill this thing. Can you go swimming in a lake with it? Can you drop it to the bottom and pick it up later and have it still working? Or I just wanna see really what it'll take to kill this thing, 10, 20 feet, however much we can get. So as a point of reference, I've got a, iPhone 6s here from an earlier video it is working and it's in a lunatic case so this thing is IP68 rated just like the Samsung Galaxy S7 so for both of these the point of this video is to test how water resistant they can be against each other and which one will survive in the end so we've got our little paint can contraption here we're gonna go ahead and put in a weight so it'll sink to the bottom and of course I do have these labeled on the string itself at 10 feet increments so we'll be able to see hopefully we get up to 15 20 20 feet that would be great so in goes the iPhone 6s uh, really you know this is a test for the 6s the people that are gonna be commenting well that's not fair and all that really uh, only reason I'm throwing this in here is because it's going in for repair <laughs> why not just put it in here anyways uh, this guy though I really want to see to what extent this will go before dying in the water so in you go and let's lock this thing up I guess we're gonna find out but uh, here is 10 feet right here and uh, the next one is a little bit down here so hoping to get 15 to 20 feet anyways if the water doesn't get to it the Hanford radiation will but here we go so drop it three two one all right there it goes so That's the 40 foot increment already, holy crap. So I'm, uh, <laughs> I really don't know how deep this goes. So this is a little bit unbelievable. It's right beneath us and I'm at the 40 foot increment right here and I can still have give way. There we go. So it, it has just touched ground. Wow. So I'd say about 38 feet. Let's let it sit there for about, let's say five minutes. Is anyone really gonna dive down there and grab this at 40 feet? Highly unlikely but I'm still curious to see if the phone will survive, or either one of them, really. So, uh, I didn't expect it to be this deep, but let's see what we got here. So once this settled, uh, it's directly beneath us. We dragged it little by little. It's a good 35 feet in the water. I'd say 36 feet. So uh, it's time to pull it out. It has been exactly five minutes, uh, going on six now. And uh, I'm, I, don't, I really don't know what to expect. The S6 did well in five feet. Let's see how he does in uh, 36. And uh, pulling, pulling. There we go. I'm surprised it didn't get snagged on any. So I did have a little water indicator on the 6S case. All right, Samsung, how durable did you make your phone? Did we kill it? Let's find out. Let's see just how durable this is. All right. So there are these guys. The iPhone. Wow, nothing. It was working when we put this case on, but now, oh, holy crap. No way. The phone is working. It just got a, wa a lot of water on the display, but wow. That is unbelievable. Lunatic. You make some good stuff. All right, so. Oh man, I think that's it. I get nothing. Let me try and hold it. Wow, so. Okay, the, it lights up. I see, I, saw, I just saw a little glimmer of light on the home button. Oh, right there. So it does light up, but the screen isn't working. Wow. You can definitely see moisture in there. I feel vibration but it's not lighting up. Fortunately, uh, the Galaxy S7 is toast after 40, almost 40 feet in the water. 35 feet is a no-go. So you'll definitely need a waterproof case for this guy, anything below five feet. 
on the other hand, IP68 rated case did so well on this guy, it's still working. That's, uh, that's really unbelievable. Wow, still dry inside, that is insane. In the end, the phone is still working. Uh, against, uh, you know, better judgment. I shouldn't be plugging this thing in, but I'm gonna go ahead and put a charger in real quick and see if it still works. All right, so here we go, plugging it in. Got a power bank here, gotta turn that on. And no signs of life. Try a hard reset and nothing, so this thing is toast. So guys, just a fun little test for me. You know, this didn't make it, but if you're gonna go in the water with your S7, don't believe it's bulletproof. I mean, this thing can still get water after a certain depth and uh, it's now just rebooting, vibrating. Yeah. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Little fun test that I decided to make uh, with my S7. Have a great day. Be sure to check out the other Galaxy S7 videos and other stuff we've been recently filming. I'll have a lot of stuff coming soon, too. Peace.